We don't have long to wait, and then Silver will pay.
The final orb! Silver's reign of terror is almost over. I am the Chronicler. I've had reports of Silver's presence in Metalon. He's reputed to have seized the palace to imprison the women. We should hurry. David, I've spoken to several of the rebels and William knows of all our plans. The longer we wait, the more time Silver has to prepare. We must confront him now. Yes, but how can we get to Metalon? It's completely isolated. I'm loath to say this, but I don't know. Metalon can't be reached by land. And if we attempt passage by boat, the ship will either be smashed on the rocks or crushed by the sea serpents protecting its shores. Burn the witch before she kills us all! Stay calm. Glass, speak your mind and be assured no one will raise their sword to you. I know of your stalemate concerning Metalon, and I can transport a small number of rebels inside its perimeters. But they'll have to make the journey to the palace on foot. How many rebels can you take? The magic my father uses to defend Metalon is powerful. Even with my own powers, I can only teleport three. Three? That'd be suicide. I'll go. And I'll take any other two willing to join me. We'd all join you. My father's power is enhanced by the blood that courses through the underground canals of Metalon. Drain even a small amount of this blood, and silver will weep. Take my glaive, it may help. Thank you. I know you've risked your life to help us. We won't let you down. Good. Now choose your companions quickly. Time is running out. Good luck. I shall record your adventures in my book of legends. Tell me of your deeds. 